everyone we just waiting here a little bit of uh, traffic I think uh, they're doing some construction yes kitty you have to wait you know <laughs> I kind of like waiting <laughs> So we are making our way to Simon Arm. Um, so yeah, we've done like a lot of driving lately. I'm probably gonna stay in Simon Arm for a little bit. It's where I used to live and all that. And I'm just gonna chill over there. Um, but yeah, we have, I think, one hour of driving. I mean, if this traffic can go, we have one hour. <laughs> we are in this little fruit stand here and I'm gonna go pick up some fresh food and after that I'm gonna go walk her yep There you go, we have a full big basket of, I think they call it a Asian pear, uh, grow here in BC, and a bag of little carrots. I used to like, my mom used to like uh, have a garden with those little baby carrots and I used to go every morning, just grab one. <laughs> they are so much sweeter than the one you purchased at the grocery store. So uh, I think we drove a little bit further, still in the, in the Simon Arm area. Um, I want to go. Kitty. <laughs> she want to go for a walk. Um, we're going to go walk her, but I want to go to a waterfall. It's been such a long time, didn't go. They were closed and it seems to be open. And yeah, find a place later on to sleep for tonight. <laughs> what? You don't like my idea? You gonna go walk you? You grumpy you what? Yeah, you grumpy? You wanna go for a walk? So a couple of years ago, when I was living in Simon Arm, because yes, I live in Simon Arm for I think three years. And that's where I rescued Kenny, by the way. I made a video about it. Uh, this whole area, we had like uh, so much rain one, sorry, one day that the whole area just flood and those big log and those big trees just collapse. It's kind of like in the valley right now. Kelly's just find a little cave. Find some cave, Kitty. She's so excited and she's just looking at all those rocks and everywhere. And yeah, the whole area just flood and that was closed for I think it was like a good three years until they remanage everything and because the Turex uh, area they just wanted to make sure those trees will not fall on people and you know what I mean? So yeah, so it's kind of like changed uh, from the last time that I saw it, which is great beautiful area I think it's called Merritt Fall um, I'm gonna put on a screen just to make sure and uh, it's just a little bit outside of Simon Arm gorgeous gorgeous area have a bridge getting This is 
this one huge tree that fell. Jenny just loves those caves. She's like, I want to go check all of them. Yeah. That's where all the mice and all the stuff hang out, can't you be? You know that. There is a family of people walking with the cage with the bird inside. I don't know what they're doing right now. I mean, I know I'm strange to walk my cat, but walking your bird? I hope they don't like plan on leaving that bird free because it's not gonna survive, obviously. It's like an exotic type of bird. I don't know what they were planning to do <laughs> but Kitty was looking at them and I was looking at them like what are you guys doing walking you bird all right uh, so yeah we're almost back to the van and I've been thinking I think I'm gonna go sleep at the first time that I slept in my car I was living in that time in Kamloops I live in Squam in Summit I'm sorry for a little while but um, I used to live in uh, Kamloops as well so um, yeah I did a road trip from Kamloops to here which is about an hour and slept for the first time here I'm gonna show you where This is the spot, the first spot that I slept with my car was right there in this uh, parking lot to uh, go from a trail. The trail is right there and it's got a beautiful view which today we're not going to see any sunset. I do have a picture of the beautiful sunset that I took at that time I think so I'm going to try to find it with uh, this house here in the bottom. But gorgeous, gorgeous view here. So if I found the uh, picture of that beautiful sunset that I took at that time, I'm gonna put it here. Um, but let's go inside, it started raining. <laughs> All right, we're gonna sleep here tonight. Uh, it's kind of nice to uh, revisit some place that I went before. Uh, like I said, I slept here probably, Kitty just making noise. <laughs> uh, probably, I don't know probably now five years ago and um, I was so stressed the first night that I went here. I was just one hour from my house. I was hoping that everything would be fine. I was, I remember I was sleeping in the back of my car in the morning. Some people arrive uh, to go for a walk and I was so stressed. I'm like, oh no, they know that I'm here. And I didn't even want to move during the night. Like I was just moving super slow just in case someone would pass by and see that I was there and see. And I was just imagining myself a bunch of things, you know, like, oh, people's gonna think I, I went in the forest and I got lost. And <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> 
<laughs> I just imagined so many things and obviously nothing happened. Everything was fine. Nobody could care. Even the morning when they saw my, my car, uh, they didn't even bother or you know what I mean? Like they didn't, they don't even look. Uh, but it's fu it's funny like the first time you sleep in your car or in your van it just imagines so many things which are most of the time wrong uh and you get used to it and now it's just like nothing you know like i have my lights on and like i'm talking to you and i know everything will be fine but the first first night was really stressful but i'm glad like you have to start somewhere and it's okay to be stressed the first night it took me like a good month before starting to feel a little bit more comfortable uh, when I was full time in my car. Uh, at just one point you just get super tired not having a good night of sleep because you just stress all the time kind of and you finally like you know fall asleep fall down asleep because you're so tired and realize oh everything is fine nobody care and you just go one other day and one other day and one other night all right guys uh i'm gonna go in bed kelly's hitting right now and i will see you in the next one uh if you're not already maybe thinking of subscribing that would be awesome give uh, this little video a thumbs up if you like it and i will see you in the next video Bye.